What's going on everybody? Shane, Originating here. Uh, back with another treasure hunting video for you. Today we are diving under one of the largest bridges in Spokane. Uh, probably the most cars go across this bridge out of anywhere in Spokane and probably um, Idaho, Coeur d'Alene as well. Uh, so it's like downtown Spokane. Um, I always find some weird stuff here. There's a lot of homeless people in this area. Uh, sorry for the noise in the background as well. There's a lot of cars going by. But uh, let me show you the bridge that we're going to be diving under. It's right there. So it's that big bridge. Thousands and thousands of cars go over it every day. And um, hopefully some people have thrown some weird and cool stuff over it. And we're going to go find it. So uh, I'll see you guys in the water. get you wet. <laughs> Here, if I throw you this end. 
that. Awesome. Appreciate it. Yo guys, what's up? We just hopped out of the water. Um, as you can see, we found a lot of awesome stuff. Uh, so, first things first, we did find a weapon. I am going to give the uh, police, the non-emergency line, a call right now. Um, so we can get the police rolling this way. I don't know, I'm not really sure how long it's going to take for them to get over here. But uh, I'll show you guys a little bit of that conversation that I have. Um, but yeah, so then we're going to do that. And then we're going to hop into all the other stuff that we found, which was a lot of cool stuff. So uh, let's get into it. All right, everybody. So uh, <clears throat> as you know, we found the gun. Uh, I'm going to give the police department a call. A non-emergency number, so I don't want anybody rushing over here. You know, it's a, it's a really old rusty gun, but I do want to turn it into them because, you know, maybe it could be sol uh, could be used to solve a crime or something or uh, just so they can have it in their system and I don't have it in my possession. Um, but, yeah, I'm going to go find the non-emergency number and we're going to give them a call right here. So, uh, see what they say. It's gonna be interesting. I've never done this before. Hey, sir. Uh, my name is Shane Steiner. I'm a scuba diver, and I found a weapon under the Spokane Bridge. Oh, okay. Did you recover it, or is it still there? I recovered it. It is in my car right now. You said you are a scuba diver, and that's how you found it. Yes, sir. Hey, what type of gun is it? Uh, it looks like a revolver. Uh, it's pretty corroded, though, so I can't really tell. But it is a pistol. And when did you discover it? Uh, about 20 minutes ago. Okay. Well, um, so they aren't, they might be sending an officer. We don't really know. Uh, he said it could be hours or even longer. So, um, I'm going to wait here for about 30, 45 minutes, see if they give me a call, see if they're going to send an officer. If not, then I'm going to give them a call back, let them know, you know, where I live, and then they'll come to where I live and they'll pick it up for me there. Um, so either way, it is going to get back into law enforcement's hands. I would like to get it out of my car as quickly as possible, but I understand that they are busy and I don't want to take up too much of their time just to, uh, just to give them this gun and uh, get it off the streets. But So yeah, we're going to go through the rest of the stuff I found. Uh, let's hop into it. Let's hop into these finds. So we found two cards. One's a VA, call, uh, like a VA vet's hospital card. Um, and then the other one is just a regular credit card. Looks like it's really old. Um, we found like a broken cup that says little perk me up. It's kind of funny. And then some other broken like glass and stuff. Um, then we found like this, I don't know what it is, a wrench maybe. I, I, I'm not really good with tool names. Uh, we found golf ball. I don't know where the other one went. I had two, but carabiner and then this little thing. <laughs> and we found like these three weird things. Don't know what any of them are. This one's like glass. It's like a light or something, but super cool. I like this one. Uh, this random tin. I'm not really sure what that is. Uh, I don't know what that is either. Uh, and then we found some electronic stuff up here. These three things. Uh, right here we found a hate license plate, which I love finding a license plate. Um, a random shirt for a restaurant 
some metal poles, a dog leash, which I hope did not have any puppies on it when it got thrown over, and then two purses, which uh, it's kind of cool. There's nothing in either of them, but um, yeah, there's like, I don't know if this is considered a purse, probably just a wallet and a purse, but separate places, so I don't think they were like the same thing. Um, and now let's move over to my favorite finds of today. Uh, so obviously we found a scooter and brought that up. Um, this is the second time I found a scooter down there. People love throwing these things over, I guess. And then we found this like knife that's like attached to a string of some sort. I probably shouldn't touch it, but uh, yeah, it's like a shank or something. I don't know. It's kind of it's kind of sketchy. Definitely get that out of there. And obviously, the best find of today, the freaking revolver. <coughs> I am super excited about finding this first weapon I've ever found um, yeah awesome cops have been called they're on the way to come pick it up shortly uh, hopefully just waiting from a call waiting from a call from them and uh, yeah but uh, let's give you guys a little overview really quick awesome so awesome and all this stuff too guys so stay tuned for me turning in the gun it will happen uh, i'm not sure if it's going to be today or tomorrow or the next day or you know whenever they get a chance but uh i am going to get it turned into the police and um it's going to be awesome so the officer just showed up um we're going to give him the gun how's it going sir do you mind if i record it do you mind if i record this just for a video okay so uh there it is it's super old um yeah i just found it while i was diving and i thought i'd turn it in at least so i didn't have it <laughs> Yeah. Okay, yeah, no problem. Just diving over in the river. Yeah, right under the bridge right here. Yeah, so. You by yourself? Yeah. Oh. Yep, I do this quite often now, so. <laughs> First weapon I found though. Okay, but, uh. Okay. Oh, <laughs> yeah, I didn't, I couldn't even tell what it was. This is like really old. Yeah, it was stuck to a rock. I had to pull it off a rock, oh. so. Um, super cool though. Yeah. I, I, first gun I've ever found while diving. Yeah, yeah and I've been diving here for like two years now, so. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, man. yeah no problem. Appreciate I appreciate you coming to pick it up. Yeah, of awesome. Yeah, you too. So, uh, the officer took it, no problem, pretty easy. Um, thankfully, I didn't have to wait here too long. I was throwing my bag of trash away and he pulled up. But uh, yeah, that's awesome. Glad to get it out of the water, get it into the officer's hands. and. Uh, now we're going to go about our day, but uh, thank you all so much for watching the video. I really appreciate it. I um, hope you have a good one, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.